So people think of space and they think this is this unpractical thing where we just have billionaires shooting rockets into space, which by the way, we see out of that window probably. Um, but the reality is that the, the a space that lies on low Earth orbit, which is called, people call it LEO, mm -hmm. um, has provided an incredible opportunity for technology to actually be used on Earth. And then you look at what you can do with someone like, like uh, Starlink from Elon Musk's companies, where with a, a smaller investment, they were able to put satellites that provide connectivity everywhere in the world, right? And it was a fraction of the investment. And that was because the infrastructure of space made it possible. The other side of space that's super interesting is that it's the ultimate test, right? And you know, that makes it that it, that makes the technologies that end up in space being kind of like the ultimate test. Mm -hmm. It came from the space program. But a lot of people don't know that Invisalign mm -hmm. is actually a product of the space program. Well, the, the, the hardness of that resin is only possible through work that was done to get things in space. And then when the when the resin and the 3D printing process were like, oh, this would be perfect for a braces replacement. So it was something that people didn't expect.